The tension is palpable and you can understand why. Two high-level sides about to face each other and it's anyone's guess how this is going to end up. It is Juventus. They take on Torino live on EA TV. plays with Juan Cuadrado in the wide positions and the tactical configuration has two players in attack from the very outset. starting lineup for Torino. Well, as you can see, they're playing with a diamond in midfield, which allows them to dominate the central area, but does leave them exposed out wide. here at the home of Juventus underway Bremer Gatti Locatelli Federico Gatti well, no luck keeping possession it might be and the keeper there to deal with it. He's driven in the corner. Well, the danger is still there. It should be foiling his opponent completely. Quadrado. Well, he really is danger personified, but in this game, Stuart, what do you think we might see from him? Well, the game plan of the coach is to get the ball into the front players as quickly as possible. He is the player to do it. He's brilliant with his back to goal. We'll link up the play, and he's key to the way they play the game. Chance to cross. Well, a poor effort when all was said and done, and simple for the keeper. Well, he's made a real mess of that, hasn't he? What a chance that was. It's there for him. Really good timing stop to make sure the threat came to nothing. And over comes the corner. Kostic. A delicious piece of skill. Real chance. Oh, dealt with by the goalkeeper. comes not all that convincing defensively just the challenge that was required and the counter attack is on options available well it petered out 
Quadrado. They're certainly allowing their opponents to come onto them. Well, it looked highly promising, but they got nothing out of it. Teammates available. Quadrado. Fed over towards the back post. Well, able to survive that attacking push. Oh, he's given it away. Good technique displayed. That is a very fine challenge in difficult circumstances. Once more, unable to hang on to the ball. Oh, nice ball over the top to chase. But it looked as though he might be on to something, but his timing left a bit to be desired. Yeah, that's frustrating, because he's just been too impatient there. He doesn't need to make his movement quite so early. Defensive roadblock in the way of that cross. Vlasic. Still pushing for that goal that would see them forge ahead. And that is how to block. Superb save. Well, he should score, of course, but that's a brilliant save. Who's going to get on the end of it? And they deal with the threat this time. Danilo. Now Quadrado. Racing forward, trying to catch them out. Will it be sufficiently imaginative? In position. Oh, a very fine header, but it wouldn't go in for him. Well, this is a big moment, and don't these fans know it? Over it comes. It might still be problematic. Long-range effort, rifled against the post, but back in play. Well, they can keep possession of it now. Well, how close were Juve to taking the lead? If they continue to play like this, you sense they'll get their noses in front soon. Outrageously skillful. Well, there it is. Juventus have controlled the possession, but they haven't done enough with it, particularly in the midfield areas, where their passing has been far too safe. And that needs to change quickly if they're to win this one. Bodies forward, and the break looks on. All hands on deck. Well, not to be in terms of the counter-attack. Into the advanced position. And a fine cross, but it wasn't quite as good as it looked when it was played over. Samuele Ricci. And that's an important intervention. Vlahovic. Can he find the net? Terrific block. Alexei Miranchuk. Perfect tackle. Still on level terms, moving the ball nicely. Sanabria! Keeper did his job to begin with. 
And there goes the half-time whistle. That will do it for the first half here in Turin. And I think it's fair to say he's had happier days in front of goal, Stuart. Well, he's been very quiet so far. He just hasn't got away from his marker. He needs to find a spark from somewhere and start testing this goalkeeper. So, the second half drama here at the Allianz Stadium. Well, not making life difficult for the keeper at all. A wide attempt. They've lost it. Dusan Vlahovic. The object of the exercise from Juventus is to get it forward. That's what they're doing. Now well, couldn't bend his run and the flag went up. This is looking threatening. Well, options at the back post here. Well, he couldn't quite keep that header down. Locatelli. Vlaovic. Just the challenge that was required. Racing forward, trying to catch them out. Do they have the guile to up and up the defence? Now, well, sadly, from their point of view, it petered out. Really vital interception. Who can he pick out? Can they forge ahead? Well, they would have done had it not been for the keeper. Well, they should be ahead now. Yes, it was a good save, Derek, but he should score from there. It's a substitution for Juventus. And he's fired over the corner. Federico Chiesa. Now Rabio. Now getting the ball forward. Chiesa. Oh, Chiesa! Wonderful block. Gets in the way once more. And space to exploit, maybe. Splendid defending, and it needed to be.
Danilo. Now Rabio. Oh, it comes to nothing in the end. Really should have made more of that. Well, they've decided to make a change. Antonio Sanabria. How can they create something? Well, it looked like a good ball, but cut out in the end. Well, Juve haven't been at their best, but just listen to these fans. They believe a winner's coming here. Quadrado. And now Rabio must take the lead here. There it is! The first goal of the derby! A special moment! in the dying embers will it prove decisive here Antonio Sanabria Voivoda excellent assessment of the situation at the back and well, the conditions look pretty good for the counter attack Locatelli there to win it back. Alexei Miranchuk. Down by a goal. This could be the final opportunity to snatch something. Oh, it's mischievous. And that's the way to keep the ball out of the net. Well, he doesn't get enough on it, does he? That's too easy for the goalkeeper, I think. Well, these fans have been brilliant. Just listen to the noise inside this stadium. Surely this will inspire the players to hang on. What a noise we've got. Quadrado. Quadrado. Fantastic work to thwart the danger. And the counter-attack is on. Options available. Voivoda. Ilic. Shot attempted. Straightforward piece of goalkeeping. Well, shortly we'll hear the final whistle. The home side with the lead. Stuart, what have you made of this? Well, it's going to be a nervy end to this game. If they do hold on, I think they've deserved their win. They've played really well and they've played some good attacking football. And in general, they've controlled the game. Well, now he's walking on eggshells, you might say. Next time it'll be yellow. And time for the change now. And the throw-in goes to Torino. Nemanja Radonjic. And the pass not quite accurate enough. And a throw in then. On the attack in the closing phase. It's looking promising. Every goalkeeper would expect to catch that one. As far as stoppage time is concerned, three minutes here. Federico Chiesa. It's with Milik. And intercepted it. Oh, 
on a perfect ball now. How about this? Well, no way through. And there it is, the final whistle. The home fans are going to be happy with this result. Well, Derek, it was very competitive. Chances at both ends, but I feel they were the better team and they deserve their victory. Well, no getting away from the fact that Adrien Rabiot has been simply superb, Stuart. Well, he was excellent today and he gave them that all-important lead. They just struggled to cope with him. His movement was so clever.